What's up everybody, welcome back to another build video. Guys, in this video I'm gonna showcase three incredible ritualist builds. I think, in my opinion, they are very unique and super powerful. First, we're gonna see a melee build. Guys, it's going to be insane. The second is going to be a maximum status damage build. And the third one is going to be a mod mage build, which uses also ritualist. I'm gonna try to keep it short, so let's jump right into it. Okay, you guys, for the Toxic Juggernaut, we're gonna use Miasma, Juggernaut, Butcher's Fetish, Xanias Malice, Probability Cord, Red Ring of Death, and Bisected Ring. On the Handgun, we're gonna use Boar and Feedback. On the melee, we're gonna need Tainted Blade. The reason why we are doing so much damage is because we are applying 5 stacks of Corroded, that's why we need Red Ring of Death as well. And on the long gun, we're gonna use Corrosive Rounds and Fed Wounds for extra 2 Corroded stacks. Shield Heart OP, if you don't use it, you lose. On the Shield Heart, we're gonna use 10% melee crit chance, 20% melee crit damage and 15% melee damage. For the armor, we are using the Bruiser set because it fits perfectly with the theme of the build. Here on the right, you can see the traits. For the updated status berserker build, we're gonna use Miasma, Rampage, Sinister Totem, Band of the Fanatic, Singed Ring, Burden of the Destroyer, a Honey Crystal Ring, Crippling Miss for 25% extra status damage with feedback. On the Krellax, we're gonna use this mutator. I'm not gonna read it because I will literally execute it. The reason why we are using this mutator is because we don't have the cooldown to keep the Miasma active all the time, so we need to extend the duration of the status effects. On the Sparkfire Shotgun, we're gonna we're gonna use corrosive rounds and twisted wounds. On the shielded heart, we're gonna use 10% elemental damage, 10% range crit chance, and 20% crit damage. I'm also using the bruiser set, you can use whatever armor you prefer. Here on the right, you can see the traits.
And last but not least, it's the God Mode 2.0. For that, we're gonna use Chaos Gate, Miasma, Spirit Wisp Amulet, Singe Drink, a Honey Crystal Ring, Burden of the Gambler, and Stone of Malevolence. On the Star Shot, we're gonna use Failsafe, a melee of your choice. On the Long Gun, we're gonna use Firestorm and Harmonizer to feed mod power to our Star Shot. On the Relic, we're gonna use 10% mod damage, 10% elemental damage, and minus 10% skill cooldown. We're gonna use Fey Royal Armor with the Zealot's Hat. And here on the right, you can see the traits. Thank you for being here, your presence is much appreciated. Don't forget to subscribe for more content like this. And that's all for now, I love you guys, I'll see you on the next one. I'm just calling to say I...